Welcome. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to identify the Intel processor in your Mac and how to find out what family it's in and find out about the specs. So when you go look at a PC at a uh, store, you might see all sorts of specs and it tells the Intel processor um, that's in there. It might have a number on it, but the Macs just say like Intel Core i5. So what you can do is on your Mac, you can open up a terminal and you can type in this command. And I'll put this command in the description so you can just copy and paste it. But it will give you this Intel Core i5 and then it says 5257U and it says CPU at 7.27 gigahertz. Okay, so what you can do is then copy this um, i5257, go to a web browser and type that in, maybe type specs. And you should get this arc.intel uh, page. So if you click that, and you'll see this lines up with the processor we have. And you can scroll down here and you can see it's the fifth generation of Intel Core i5. It's a product formerly Broadwell. It says it's mobile, uh, and this is in a laptop. Um, it's in a MacBook. It tells you when it came out. Um, you know, it's a 14 nanometer process. Uh, how many cores, how many threads. It gives you all the specs, cache, you name it, um, on this. So you can learn everything about your process, processor and like what technologies it supports. Like it has uh, uh, Intel QuickSync, um, OpenGL. Um, I think somewhere on here it lists um, virtualization, things like that. So then I'll also put a link to this. This is Wikipedia. It says list of Intel CPU microarchitecture. So you see this. Um, Broadwell here you can scroll down here and look for Broadwell and These were like classes of processors. So this will kind of tell you uh, It's a 14 nanometer process. So you'll see these a lot in the media that uh, Intel's coming out with the coffee lake processor and it's you know 14 nanometer blah 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 um, it Has all the specs on it. So you can kind of tell um, like if you see something that has a Sandy Bridge processor you know, that's an older generation than the Broadwell or whatever. So um, so that's just a tip on how to learn more about your Mac and its capabilities. Um, I know Apple doesn't always tell you all these things, so um, this is just how you can look it up. But if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.